Session one, getting started with ECCAD for pipe. Once the program is loaded, you will notice up on the ribbon there are several commands that we'll be using throughout the functionality of the ECCAD. But the first thing you want to do is you want to set up your default template. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over here to the big red A and we're going to select options. As the options screen comes up, we're going to be on the files tab and we're going to come down to template settings. In our set template settings, we want to go to default template for file name QNew and then we want to browse to where the file we want to start with lives. So we're going to select the browse button and this is going to live under your C drive, program data, you'll scroll down and you'll see the Trimble EC CAD. From here, we're going to go to the Trimble EC CAD for AutoCAD MEP 2021, and we'll open that. Under that, you're going to see several folders, but we want to select the template folder, and we want to select the EC Start Drawing template as our default template. So we're going to go ahead and select that, and then hit Apply and OK. Now when we go to select that template by going up here and selecting this piece of paper for new, that's opened up our EC Start Drawing template that already has a lot of our routing preferences preset. The next step that you'll want to do is you'll want to, each time you start up a new AutoCAD MEP EC CAD session, you'll want to come up and load the catalog. So you'll go to the load catalog icon and you can select from several different catalogs. This session I'm going to load the EC CAD pipe. As you go ahead and select to load the parts, you're going to see on the command line that the parts are being loaded. And this will take approximately a minute to 90 seconds to load this catalog. Now that your catalog is loaded, you can come up to the ribbon and select Manage. And we're going to come over here to the Style Manager pull down, and we're going to look at our pipe routing preferences. Pipe routing preferences are stored in your drawing template. So we loaded this template earlier, and this has our EC routing preferences set up. So for instance, if I select EC Thread by Weld and go to look at the preferences that are set up here, you can see here I've got a size limit here of half inch to two inch, and I'm using my anvil parts here. To select the parts, you simply go to that line and go to your pull down, and now you can see these are all real manufacturer's parts. So these are what comes set up with your template. To draw with these, you'll just go ahead and go back out of here. Just simply come to your home tab and select pipe. When you select pipe, everything will be changed on your template. So if we come back over here, I've got this set up for my chilled water system. So I'm going to go ahead and just select chilled water. And I want to run with my thread by weld. Here is where I select my size of my pipe. So I'm going to go ahead and say I'm going to run with the 8-inch pipe. I've got the 252 inch or 21 foot cut length on this and I'm running it at an elevation of 9 foot 11 and a quarter and holding the pipe by the center. Most everything that you change in here is going to be in your properties palette and we will cover this more in another session. But now as I go ahead and I place this pipe down into my drawing here and go ahead and just place this in and I want to turn the corner here I'll just go ahead and do a 90 degree turn on that. Right click enter will end my command but now this is placed for me as I hover over this fitting. You can see that placed my well bend carbon steel 90 degree elbow. Now we will go ahead and continue in another session to show a lot of the different drawing options to get you started. We hope you enjoyed this video. See what's next in our product tips playlist or visit mep.trimble.com for even more product resources.